Yes. What are you here for? <laughs> no, I'm not asking. <laughs> you need to stay with me. All right, we're trying to get... Hi, beautiful people. If you clicked on this channel, then you want to learn about essential oils. Let's start with how or where do the essential oils come from. They're actually the extracts from plants or flowers. <laughs> Wait, don't click, don't click. <laughs> I went ahead and I used to get um, essential oils from both doTERRA and then I switched over to Young Living. Both are wonderful companies of essential oils. And anytime you purchase essential oil, you want to purchase an essential oil that um, doesn't have any bad ingredients in it or the way that it's processed, um, that it's not chemically processed. Um, there's different methods on the way that they um, use and if you wanna know more information about that, um, like the seal to seal and the way they audit, the way that they make the essential oils, you can just go onto those companies and actually um, see what they use to go ahead and um, audit those. But um, just so you get a gif of what essential oils are, they're actually the extracts from the plants or flowers. and you can use them holistically. You don't want to use them um, in replacement of any medicine or medications or anything like that. It can assist you with any issues that you have. So let's say, for example, if you have a headache, um, there's essential oils that can assist um, with the headache. So um, for example, using peppermint, you can rub it on your um, temples or the back of the neck, along, of course, with your headache medication if it's um, not working. You can first try the peppermint oil and of course, you know, again, essential oils are not a replacement for medications, but it's an assistance to help you or add that additional support um, to you if you have those, any issues or anything. I personally, I love to use it in my beauty routine care. I love to use the essential oils on my scalp. I actually add peppermint to my lip gloss. I also add lavender to my mascara to my eyelashes and it also makes them curl a little more with um, when I add it to the mascara. Uh, I actually sell essential oils through Young Living and this is a new adventure for me that I just started. I've actually been using essential oils for a while. I actually started with doTERRA and now I went over to Young Living just because Young Living gives me a little bit more options. They have makeup and different types of um, nutri nu um, nutritional drinks and everything as opposed to doTERRA. Both are amazing companies. I would just suggest to you when you purchase an essential oil that you make sure that it's an essential oil that is from a reputable company. Now, when you go ahead and you purchase an essential oil, you wanna make sure the way that they are making the essential oils are of quality. So it's the way that they're making it, the chemicals that they're using, or the actual scientific method behind the way they um, do it. You wanna make sure that it's um, of high quality. You don't want um, something to be of low quality where they add all these um, fillers and ingredients that you have no idea what they're putting in it, and then you're inhaling these oils and they end up doing more harm than um, good to your body. Some of the ways that you can use essential oils are to help with headaches, numerous of things and ways that you can use these oils and few, um, some of the ways right now in a brief overview is I go ahead and I use it in my beauty care routine. I use them on my scalp. Uh, I also add uh, essential oils to my lip gloss. I put a little bit of like one or two drops of peppermint in my lip gloss, I add a drop of lavender to my uh, to my mascara, which helps the the lashes curl a little bit more as opposed to just um, using the mascara by itself. And I, if you have them, try to embrace what you have. Sure. People, can you believe I'm gonna be turning 40 in a couple months? With that said, yay! No. With that said, um, I want to take you guys on my healthy, physical, and mental beauty journey as I go along entering my 40s. Just to let you know, I... Okay, pause it. I got stuck there. Take one. Or 55. <laughs> I don't know if you can see this. Can you see this? Are you 
depresivos. Okay, this is CBD calming oil um, by Young Living. They work with Nature's Ultra. And I actually use this anytime I am anxious. Uh, I actually suffer from anxiety. And uh, this actually helps me uh, calm down. And like anytime I'm feeling anxious, I go ahead and rub this behind my ears, my neck, on my wrist. And I actually add it to my bracelet here. It's actually an infusion bracelet that I have an essential oil. And I just roll it on there anytime I'm feeling stressed. I also use this um, before I go to sleep to help me sleep. If you have issues sleeping, this can also help you go to sleep. But these are just many, one of many ways that essential oils can help you in your life. And if you're on that um, journey to better health, mentally, physically, uh, essential oils is a way to go to just as an additive to your journey to help you um, through each stage so if you're interested in essential oils I'm going to go ahead and link my essential oil young living website above right here and just click on it and you can go ahead and um, purchase those essential oils if you have any questions you can just go ahead and put your questions below and I'll go ahead and answer those questions for you. Thank you. Hi, beautiful people. So anyways, 